Hi, welcome to Pictures, Noise and Words. I'm Hedgy. I'm Paris. And this is Parasite Inc. Um, this was a request um, by Hoppy, who has had requests before. I think you've, I think you've used up your request credits, Hoppy. Uh, but um, yeah, melodic death metal band, according to themselves. I like a bit of melodic death metal. I think, Very yeah, good. definitely like a bit of melodic death metal, if it's true. <laughs> uh, I haven't heard this, genuinely haven't heard this. They're from Germany. Um, and it, I don't know, what's the thing about Germany? I think you can get any kind of sort of... There's something German about German music, so I think, a lot of the time. You can almost pick out German power metal. Go on. <laughs> Do you not think... It's just <laughs> that they have a sound. Um, it's not quite as, like... I don't know. It's not as strong as the Japanese one, but I always, or I hear bands and I think they sound they sound German. Is it German or just European in general? Maybe it's just European and I'm just yeah. lumping them all together. Because um, I, admittedly, I wouldn't know if they were from Austria or uh, you know, <laughs> <laughs> or, or maybe Italy. Yeah, no, you know what? I think maybe I would know if they were from Italy. I don't know. Do you want to spade? Yeah, no, I know. Like, you, maybe I should just start, you. not look it up, just start <laughs> guessing and then see what my hit rate's like. It'd probably be appalling. Um, but you know, we used to listen to a lot of bands from Germany, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That Gamma Ray and, you know, and Halloween. Pa Power Wolf and Power Wolf. And Power Wolf. Yeah, um, just click on that. Ooh, I've heard the mouse go. Yeah, you're left handed. It's not, not easy. Um, Paris, this is how modern melodic, melodic death metal should sound. Absolutely fitting growls, strong guitar leads, and killer choruses. This have got a lot to live up to. And I can read that because I've got the new glasses. Well, for a second, I well. thought they were saying that about themselves, but no, they're not, are they? Somebody, somebody did say it yeah, about them. Yeah. It's like, wow, that's brave. That's, 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 that's big enough. <laughs> we yeah. are what things should sound like, <laughs> yeah, you know. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, so uh, it's a song called, he says, it's clicking back. The pulse of the dead. That's a good. That's a. That's going to be a slow one then. <laughs> <laughs> and it's off this album, um, called "Time Tears Down." And this is not a new song. It's like 2013. It's not exactly ancient, but quite often we're doing stuff that's not even out yet, aren't we? So this is six years old. We'll just get on with it, I think, because um, I've run out of things to say. Um, we're in elite dangerous land. I'm not even making you guess the game. Um, it's a fantastic game. It does look like that, but I can't recommend it because the learning curve is vertical. So, um, and you literally have to invest in hardware to play it, you know. And but in VR, it's just incredible. And if anyone was interested in, in the last one, when we were sat in hospital. Oh, yes. The, um, Where it was two games. That was the, yeah, that was the trick. Left 4 Dead and Payday 2 crossover level. No mercy. Yeah. Yeah, in Payday, they took yeah, a... I spent far too many hours in that They game. took the Mercy Hospital uh, bit of Left for Dead, didn't they? Yeah. And it was very clever, actually, yeah. what they did with it. So, yeah, it was... So, there you go. Left for Dead and Payday. You spent far too many hours in Payday, don't you, still? Still. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So... Love it. Okay. Don't know why I did that. Just, just seemed like things do. Well, I <laughs> click over here. Just get on with Just it, man. Get on with it. It's <laughs> Time to listen to this. this. The it's these I, ha I have to click a button over there, right? It's about this big. It's a marvelous piece of software design. The button is literally, right, and I'm trying to do that. <laughs>
Turns out the dead do have a pretty good pulse after all. That's great, but I <laughs> love that. I, I'm going to swear that. I bloody love that. That was, that was great. Where's my pen gone now? I don't know. You've got a pen that, that is there. Oh, it's ninja pen. It it's, in my, it's in my hat. Well, that's going to have to go in my book too. So that's two. two. <laughs> it's going in both books, that one. <laughs> Doink. I'll analyse it in a minute. Um, yeah, music sales will be back in a second. <laughs> if I was driving my car, <laughs> I would look down and suddenly realise I was doing 90 miles an hour. <laughs> Because uh, that's what a what a driving song, and I don't mean a driving song. I mean, it, it's because it wasn't fast, was it? Tempo wise, but how do you, how do you explain this? Um, mm -mm. I thought the, the opening riff was killer, and we, you keep talking. I just need to see I, I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to commit myself here, but rarely do we have bands with such killer riffs like that straight from the outset that just draw you in usually got um i don't know if that sounds a bit unfair in all the other bands but uh we don't get i don't i love that sort of stuff and we don't see it enough i think is what i'm trying to say that only riff is brilliant oh, I see. um i love the mix and the production of it the guitar sound especially <coughs> is one of the best guitar sounds i've heard on this channel i thought that was amazing because it, it it was dirty but clean and not overly distorted uh, and everyone will know what i mean <laughs> um and there's a, there was a bit where the two it was just the two guitars before i think it was before the second chorus uh it just it just sounded lovely and and the production on the drums was fantastic and he didn't always just play the normal beat i like the bit which i started to do that that's quite cool it's simple but effective <laughs> yeah get the maracas out um yeah and i liked his vocal as well um and the music changed in the chorus hence the melodic side side of it um and it i, th I think it, it's it feels like a band of um musicians with a putting in a vocal which is why i think you didn't get that many vocals um in it yeah but when the, the music, i thought the music the was outstanding solo started it was after a musical interlude or, you yeah know, like at the end of a musical interlude when i thought he was going to sing again they started a solo and i yeah. thought oh i didn't see that coming. yeah that, that musical interlude it was great you liked it then i did yeah uh, uh what so. he said uh <laughs> yeah it was really good and you know those tiny little bits that you think wow that was cool i've just queued it up so oh, cool. there's a bit where and it's so casual and throw away and you probably probably didn't even see it happen when the singer goes to sing for the first time he chucks his guitar behind him yes he does but yes. the way he did it was just i thought oh now that was cool because it was <laughs> like i'm doing it you know it quite i've thing. done this a hundred times so i watch the singer as he comes up uh, i'll put the sound on again watch the singer as he just as he goes to the microphone <laughs> <laughs> it's just so whew, yeah, yeah done this hundred times let's get on with it sort of thing and i just as soon as i saw that i went i thought that, that was cool <laughs> just, yeah. wow that was cool um, find these. but yeah love the sound of it and i love the driving nature yeah. of it yeah it just it just you know um yeah the so, yeah the structure was really tight for uh four minutes they, they four cut, minutes yeah. it felt like they cut away all the chaff and just kept all the strong ideas they didn't overdo the vocals they didn't need to, if you don't need to put in a second verse or third verse cut it out just keep that and i think that's what without it being fast that's what makes a song drive is because there's always changing from good idea to good idea yeah because before you get uh what is it yeah uh, and, and this has been out since 2013 it's had 6.3 million views so clearly yeah i've yeah. just been missing it i've <laughs> yeah, just missed too. it somehow yeah. um so yeah, I'm glad it's working it's out. Good, for it's them. a good video. It's a simple video as well. I like, I like the blue wash, but some of the uh, camera angles as well and the lighting were, were very effective. Yeah, I mean you can do a lot with smoke, mm. can't you? It's like yeah. 
I'll switch it back on so people can see. You know, you can do a lot with smoke. You can hide a lot of the. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell for though. Look at that pose. <laughs> they caught me right at the. Yeah, you can yeah, just right you can, you, there. Because yeah. there's not there's nothing there. Um, no, no. But it but it works really well. Yeah. So we'll just fill it with smoke and we'll put some gets a lot of blue lights on and <laughs> some filters on the camera. Great stuff. Yeah. Good start to this so, fish. Definitely. Uh, thanks, Hoppy. Um, is it? Is he got a bonus credit for that? Oh, do we? Do we? Give, do we give him a bonus credit? Yeah, okay. Bonus credit. Um, I struggled with Gorguts because it was very old, which is one of his earlier uh, recommendations. Um, but the production on this is just so good. Yeah. Uh, yeah really good. Uh, yeah. Re really, really enjoyed it. Let us know what you think. They, they're still going, by the way. Checked out their Facebook. They, they you know. They're still going. Maybe they've got something bang up to date, but this is this was the request. So uh, yeah, thanks for that. Good one. See you soon. See you now. Bye bye. bye.